attack this guy who has Daredevil. Oh, he's already in an arena match. Just kidding. All right, we'll try to figure out this Drax thing. Man, I've had a lot of trouble with this. Okay, so this is far right, this is back right, this is middle, this, these two are switch basically, and this one's far left. So as you're looking at these things, this is always your far left guy, which means Jugs and Drax are next to each other. So I should be able to ability block them with vision, and then disrupt him after the taunt goes away, I think. Man, but that speed up from Widow throws a wrench in my turn thoughts. Maybe Vision can dispel too. I'll have to see. I'm going to try that and see if this works. I'll throw a Vision in here. It'll also provide um, defense up for Starlord and Rocket right off the bat. So they could potentially resist the blind, but it's very unlikely. Yeah, this team gives me a lot of problems. I haven't, I haven't quite figured it out. That Widow is interesting because she provides speed up, but these guys get speed uh, meter from getting hit, which is interesting. All right, so I'm going to waste the um, rocket special, and the reason why is because I don't want to give Jugs extra turn meter. And then... I gotta do it again with Star Lord. Um, since I don't, well, yeah, I can waste his blind now and hope I get Pyro. Nice. Okay, so that works. And then we're gonna ability. Oh my god, I forgot he was blind. Oh my god. <laughs> and then if we do disrupt, shit. Yeah, this just doesn't work. We do the disrupt on him, so he can't taunt again. But now we're stuck fighting Juggernaut. Pyro hits, and that hurts. Yeah, we can shoot people with rocket, which is nice. Uh, oh man, shooting this Jugs just feels useless because he's so powerful with that defense up, and I don't think Vision's going to be able to remove his buff. Yeah, that's just going to make him charge faster and murder everyone. And we'll blind everyone. So that gives us at least one turn of not dying. See, now that is interesting. So it did land the blind on the Juggernaut. So that means there is potential there to get that blind in prior to his uh, ult, even if he does, uh, yeah, let's kill Pyro, do some damage. Let uh, Drax run through here and get some people, kill that Magneto. And then really the Juggernaut is the most powerful left. I mean, this works, but this is not a great method. <laughs> uh, let's do another blind. Oh, now you resisted. Let's do that, see if we can get rid of his death proof. And I don't think he's anywhere near getting his uh, taunt back, so we should be okay there. And we'll keep hitting this Jugs. Man, this is such a tough fight, I'll tell you. If you're looking for an arena of defense to invest in, I would highly recommend this one. This Brotherhood plus Drax is a real pain in the ass. <laughs> Let's blind him. Yeah, okay. So now I got that through. <laughs> Man, that was crazy. So that worked, but I mean, I screwed up there. I used my vision ability block when he was still blind, and that was stupid of me. I forgot I didn't have a cleanse. I needed to wait one turn, but had he done his basic, he would have hit jugs and missed and still, you know, made this turn meter run up. And so that's a conundrum here. It's just all these turn meter things and then throwing a widow in it to give them all speed up or chance of speed up is just 
just makes it even harder to figure out and plan for because there's just so much speed and so many things to consider with the additional uh, turn boost. So, okay. So we'll finish this one now. Um, we got four minutes until re or till payout, so I'll spend the cores and see if I can jump up once more just to be safe. Um, but yeah, let's see. Oh, this is an interesting one. Groot, Rocket, Star-Lord, and then Magneto and Juggernaut. Let's see. I think my current comp could quite easily take that. So, yeah, because we'll need some uh, disrupt from Magneto. Um, our ability block from... Uh, Vision would be perfect on the Groot, so he doesn't get to buff everybody. But yeah, let's go for it. Let's just see. I haven't fought this comp before. I have no idea if this is uh, going to work, but we'll see. And then I got two minutes and 20 seconds until payout. <laughs> Keeping it close. All right, so they blind. That's fine. And then Rocket will um, just shoot over here and do nothing. And yeah, that's fine. Do a little damage. And we're going to blind. Oh, shit. The Groot already got his taunt up. Damn it. All right. So we're going to blind whoever we can. Let's hope that he can survive. So Vision still has his blind on. So we need to watch that. And now we're going to blind everybody with Magneto's unavoidable thing. But he gets slow from Groot, which is annoying. But that's fine. Uh, and oh, he cleansed it. I forgot Groot has that stupid buff. All right, so offense up rocket alt definitely does a lot of damage. Um, that's kind of cool. And really, there's no reason to waste his ult on him. We'll go ahead and see if we can. Clear. Oh my god, he's blind again. Oh shit. I keep forgetting to look at him down there. Let's see if we can land that disrupt. There we go. That and then whew, let's just do some damage to him. Get the assist going. We're gonna get some blinds out and see if we can save some health. Alright, no, don't kill my guys. Alright, let's see if we can get Star Lord down. Get that death proof off, and then let's let Rocket sweep him away. And then Juggernaut's not a big deal. Uh, if I kill the Groot, he's gonna do that whole regrowth thing and give everybody buffs so we want to avoid that and I got 30 seconds until uh, all right so he's about to die I got 20 seconds to pay out so I'm gonna let this tick down a little bit so that wasn't too hard of a fight um, I de definitely could have played that better but I haven't played this before and I'm really not used to fighting Groot very much <laughs> I haven't seen him in our shard a whole lot all right five seconds till all right let's Oh, fuck, I forgot to respawn. Shit. Oh, my God, I just fucked that up. Stupid fucking Groot. Dickhead. Ah! I never fight Groot. I just never see him in our shard. I totally forgot. Ah, it doesn't matter. I didn't get bumped, and I didn't jump up either. Ah. Well, let's see, actually. Who did get... Oh, Savitar got knocked to 10. Who was I hitting? Was it him? I don't remember. Can't keep track of all these people. But yeah, that was a, kind of a fail on my part. I totally forgot Groot can revive. Is it always a revive? I actually don't even know. I gotta look. This is... I gotta do some homework. Alright, I am Groot. 10% chance to revive. And then this gives him plus 5. On death, always blah, 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 blah. And if, okay, so he has like a 20% chance if you max his thing and get the two turns slow on him. Ah, uh, and I guess most people would do that if you build Groot. That's two turns slow is pretty sweet. Um, hmm. Yeah, it's only like a 15 or 20% chance that he would revive. But yeah, I should have started hit attacking uh, prior to the reset just a little bit and see if he revived. You know, because whenever you have one of these you know, end uh, fight guys that can either dodge or evade or something, and uh, or you're not quite sure if you're going to kill them because you don't actually know how many health points they have, and you're just looking at that stupid little meter. Um, 
you just want to be safe and uh, you know start start attacking about 10 seconds before the ending of your uh, payout period just to be sure that you get it done in time it'll give you a better chance of at least staying where you are if nothing else maybe moving up but you know um, yeah if you got it like that uh, it works but here I am rank six now and uh, this defense I've only lost twice since I employed this defense uh, couple of days ago uh, or at least that's what I've noticed as far as being knocked down so uh, this is working um, I don't know why uh, I think it's just people are probably scared of the rocket alt and the juggernaut alt and magneto blind initial helps and then having to deal with Drax's initial taunt plus his second turn taunt uh, I put him over here away from juggernaut so you can ability block Drax if you want to but it'll only ability block magneto which is just that disrupt special so it's not a big deal I guess somebody might be able to uh, dis or ability block Magneto if they can go before he uses his ult, but I don't I don't really see that happening. So we'll see. Um, but that defense seems to be holding pretty good, and it's only uh, for me it's 220. Grand Archard probably isn't that uh, high up there as far as like yeah you can see like the highest is 250 ish uh, as far as like competent teams go. Um, you know our PIDs are in the seven millions so. Uh, it's uh, you know, it's not like it's it's a little after launch shard basically, um, so that's that's our grouping, and I think we just got merged the other day too because that happens. So anyway, um, so that was two wins, not too bad. Um, did beat a Drax Brotherhood team, which is nice, but I would not say that that method is uh, sustainable. <laughs> I think it was a little RNG uh, luck on my favor there. Um, but it worked at least. It's something you can try, and I'm going to try to tweak that and make it better. See if I can get some better videos of that to share and try to really solve this uh, Drax plus Brotherhood conundrum that is currently the meta. So I'll be posting those when I get them. Uh, if I have any, um, you know, success or uh, interesting ideas, I'll, I'll be sure to post them. So stay tuned.